guys, so today I'm going to talk about an anime that I absolutely adore and love and never finished it, to be honest with you guys, but I have watched a few episodes, the movies, and I absolutely adore it. I love it so much. Card Capita, Card Capita Sakura. It is one of the cutest animes in my opinion. And from what I remember, it's been a little bit since I watched it, to be honest. So I'm a little, yeah, I've kind of, yeah. But it is coming back in 2018 for an anime for Cleo Card Capital TV anime adaption. It is happening. It is coming back in 2018 for a new anime series. It says, an early look at the January issue of Sojo Magazine, Naki Yoshi, out in Japan. The summer first has revealed the details for the long-teased new Card Capital Sakura anime project. Coming in the January 2018 NHK podcast, the TV anime will be adapting the color, will be adapting the clear cloud chapter a manga that revisits the young magical girl Saka Kinamoto in her junior high school years. That story began running in Naki Yoshi's July 2016 issues to celebrate the 20th anniversary of the Clamps manga. Mario Mario, hopefully I pronounced that right, Asaka returns to direct the Madhouse Project. Cast is likewise returning. Sakura Kinamoto, Sakura Tanji, Super Aya Hikasawa, Tomoyo Daijoji, Daijoji, hopefully I pronounced that right, Junko Aiwa. That's the cast, you guys, right there. And here's um, a picture. So I am very excited for this anime, you guys. I love it so much. Um, I'm going to try to finish it before 2018 so I can know everything I need to know and get caught up and stuff. So another anime that I'm going to talk about is... Where's it at? Cold Geese. Oh my goodness. I've watched all the episodes. I watched one of the Uvas if I remember correctly. I have finished the original anime series and I loved it. What a great story. Oh, what a great ending. And it's been several years since the series has ended, you guys. Like, I think... I might correct me if I'm wrong, you guys. I believe... 10 years or so, something like that. Um, it has been a long while. I haven't watched it in quite a while, but I did finish it and the ending was insane and I love the ending. I feel like it gave it a closing the way it should have and I feel like we didn't, it ended really well where we didn't need any more questions, answers, stuff like that is my, my opinion. I'm a little bit mixed on the news that we just recently received about Code Geass. A new anime is coming. They are getting a season three, you guys, a season three. Season three. It's like, what? I'm a little mixed emotions about this. Um, okay, well, I'm going to read the article. One of the articles I just found about it. During the 10th anniversary event of the Code Geass anime, it was announced that a brand new anime titled Code Geass The Loss of the Resurrection is in, is in production. I believe, if I remember correctly, Lilaus died in the last episode. So, correct me if I'm wrong though, if I'm not, if I'm wrong. From what I remember, he died. He got stabbed or shot, something like that. He died. So, what is going to happen? Lulauts? The resurrection of Lulauts? What? Like, how are they going to have that happen? Like, the only, I see the only way it happening is if something, a new enemy is coming into the 
place and trying to destroy everything that they build and stuff like that in the series. Then he's got to come out of the shadows and fight, but how are they going to do that? I don't understand. I don't... Um, it was also confirmed that Lelox was start in the new sequel anime. What? I don't understand. I'm excited. Like I said, I'm mixed. I'm excited, and I want to see how it's going to go. It can, it can go bad. It can go good. It could be better than the new Simon series, or it could be worse. I don't know. I'm excited. I don't know how to explain it. But here's a picture that they posted on the thing. So I'm pretty excited and um, the new anime will be a sequel set years after Zero Rectum. The final events of the anime's second season go with Tan Tan Shigishi. To correct me if I'm wrong if I pronounce that wrong. The director of the previous anime have also confirmed that Code Geass The Last of the Resurrection will be a sequel. Details about the format of the new anime have yet to be revealed. In addition, there will be three compilation films of previous Code Geass anime. The films are set to release in January 2017 and will contain new audio. I will do reviews and stuff on that as well and reactions to that when it comes out in January. The event anniversary of America Code Geass Han Hanukkah Gyaku no Lelouch Code Geass Lelouch of, Re of the Rebellion celebrated the anime's 10th anniversary. The main cast members of the anime attended the event. It began in 2000, it, the series began in October 2006 Running for a total of 25 episodes, the anime was followed by a second season, 2008. Um. Yeah, and here's another picture they posted. I hope you can see it, I'm not sure. I hope so. Uh, um, I will... Do a review and more depth into it when trailers and more information. But I'm so excited for this card capital soccer anime adaption, even though we have to wait a year and some months for it because it comes out in 2018. So it's at least a year from now. But we don't know when it does in eight, if I'm correct. Uh, and then. We have no release date for Code Geass either. Any other information on Code Geass? I'm so mixed emotion about it, you guys. I don't know what to think. I really don't know. I really don't know. But I love you guys, and um, I'm sorry if I don't know how to explain myself for all you guys, but I try my best to entertain you guys and because I love informing you guys. Um, as soon as I hear about something, I try to film it as immediately. As soon as I hear about something, I'll try to film it for you guys immediately as soon as I can and up edit it and upload it and upload it to let you guys know as soon as I know something of an um, anime, manga, cosplay, whatever it is, I try to keep you guys informed. I love you guys and see you in another video.